Vlogging day 919. You know the only distinguishing features of me is that I'm curmudgeon -y, I smoke, and I have a mustache, and I'm not even a Yankees fan. Just found this hat in a dumpster one day and I figured I'd keep it. Good morning. It's Wednesday. I know I'm a little bit sideways right now. And it's not Wednesday, it's actually Monday. That's how quickly I've already lost track of everything. I've spent the entire day inside working on uh, translating scripts. I have a few more things I have to get done before going out to see some people this evening. But I had to get out of the house, so at least go for a run. Because if I didn't go for a run, I was going to go crazy. I was also going to miss my goal for the week, even though I was very close to meeting you without going for a run. So, yeah, I got to go for a run. This is apparently the week that Paris decided it was time for winter to officially start. It is miserably cold here, like freezing cold almost. I don't know how cold it is, but I'm, you know, I'm sure I'll get used to it eventually. Not as cold as where my parents are. Many of you in Canada I know are struggling through a lot of snow. So, you know, should I complain? No. Will I complain? Maybe, just a little bit. But it definitely makes things a little bit more exciting when you're out for a run, I suppose, and you know, starting to freeze. I do miss having an ice beard. I look forward to having that again. That's about it. Foggy glasses, what can I say? I also picked up another, it was an article by Insider just talking about like YouTuber burnout and I get it. I really understand it. As far as the pressure like to continue to create and how a lot of people end up burning out and how a lot of big YouTubers, especially after a while, really burn out because the level of pressure on them is way bigger it is than on somebody like me. But I do feel that pressure. Most of it is internal. I feel like most of the pressure that I have to create that might push me towards burnout is an internal pressure. And this is, I know, totally random aside because who knew that that was gonna come out of Jay going for a run when he's just trying to free himself from the oppression of office life within his tiny little chateau that's not supposed to be an office, but it feels like an office today. But that's part of it is like, I definitely crammed a lot more into this weekend than I intended to, both with Having friends coming into town, that was great, well planned for, but then having like all of this translation work dumped on me last minute, wanting to make sure that I get that done and do it well by tomorrow, as well as like having to apply for something today that I need to go home and do, which is why I'm doing my vlog just while I run and that's probably gonna be about it. I have a lot of random stuff that I need to get done before we you know have a nice kickoff tonight for my friends before we send them off, as well as investigate a couple of new bars on a little bit of a bar crawl that's not a bar crawl, explicitly was said, was told it was not a bar crawl, we're only having one drink per place so we can try it because apparently it's cocktail week in Paris. So if you're in Paris right now, enjoy cocktail week because that's apparently what's going on right now. I'll try to give you more information about that maybe tomorrow as I learn about it tonight. But all that to say, this is also me trying to say like, I'm gonna go for a run, which will be good for my health. And I'm gonna make a shorter video today, which will also be good for my health because otherwise I'm gonna be overdoing it, staying up late as I try to reboot my sleep schedule, which is also not going super well because once you get on a late sleep schedule and you're a night owl who likes to work at night like me, I'm really productive at night. Good luck getting back into like, a, you know, waking up in the morning and having coffee at the regular human time of day kind of lifestyle. Just, I don't hate sleeping in. It feels like I've already wasted half the day when I do. Anywho, that's enough of that. I need to keep running to keep my heart rate up. Well, I have to say I hope that you're doing well wherever it is you are. I feel like I'm doing great since I've started this year off really trying to take a little bit more time for myself, make some space for myself, try to make sure that like I have a priority of actually watching out for my own mental health, sleeping more, making sure I'm getting regular exercise, making sure that everything comes together one way or another so that I've got a happier, healthier balance and, and letting off some of that pressure that I put on myself to create at the level that I wish I was creating literally every day for the rest of my life, but know that I physically can't because, you know, I'm human, as it turns out. One of those things that I'm, I'm slowly starting to grapple with, even though I really don't think that I am. I think, I still think I'm kind of superhuman. Anyways, this run is going pretty well. I feel nice and warmed up and staying in the sun as long as possible. Major bonus, running at night right now would probably, I, I would die. And so I'm gonna leave you here, I think, just as an act of self-control more than anything. Self-respect and self-control. Keep it short, combine the run with the video portion, go home, edit it, finish applying for that thing I need to apply for, probably do a little bit more revision work on those scripts, and then head out and say goodbye to some friends tonight. And I will see you bright and early tomorrow morning for yet more Paris, probably at greater length. Hopefully getting out of my room and exploring the city a little bit, because let's be honest, I don't want to stay in my room all day. Like, I, ah, I've done it now, like two days in a row. I gotta get out. I'll see you for that tomorrow. Adios.